there is this land issue. Yeah. What, what, is, what is his name? Shem. Yeah. Dr. Shem. Dr. Shem. He's his political party that is the economic freedom fighters. Don't so don't ever leave their point of view out because he's gonna bring it right back to you. So we always want to know the political fighters' point of view. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the, the the economic freedom fighters they've uh, uh, they, they they are bringing they want to bring back the land to the its rightful owners. Right. That was it, it's what was left by our own. That is Robert Sobukwe and his political party in 1959 when they when he started his party broke away from the ANC in 1955 because of the document of the ANC that is the Freedom Charter that is saying people shall share in the wealth of this country equally and then there was a question among the leadership of the ANC that uh, if we share something you come with your piece of cake I come with my piece of cake and then we share <laughs> so if you say uh, people of this country must share in the wealth of this country equally. What they did, what did they come with from Europe? Nothing. Nothing. Gone. Nothing. <laughs> Nothing. Nothing. They came with Bibles. Bibles, yeah, Bibles. And then, and, 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 then, and then in Clip Town in 1955, there were disagreements. And then the ANC leadership, as the one big political party, broke away. There were two parties that came out of the ANC. That was the Pan-Africanist Congress of Azania, that was the PAC, led by Robert Sobukwe, and another party, that was the Azapo, Azanian People's, Liber Azanian People's Organization, led by Stephen Bantu people. <coughs> so, both parties, Robert Sobukwe believed on the United States of Africa. Stephen Bantu Pico believed on black consciousness. Uh, both leaders died in the same year. Yeah. Stephen Bantu Pico, because of what he believed, he never changed his cue. He was detained or taken away from King Williamstown naked in a van yeah. driven all the way from King Williamstown in the Eastern Cape to Pretoria at the back of the van naked went to the cell in Pretoria they beat him up and he died in a cell Robert Sobukwe being prisoned in 1960, 1960 in Robben Island being isolated from other inmates had about 11 security guards every day isolated in his house and being poisoned his food and died in Kimberley in 1978 mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. so I'm coming back to this land issue those were the two leaders that fought about the land. And now EFF came up, born in 1913, led by one of our own young, vibrant leader, born in, 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 in Pulukwane, born by an epileptic mother, housewife, not a housewife actually, a domestic worker. Went to school, flanked or guided by the late Mama Winnie Mandela to love education. And now, because ANC couldn't get uh, disciplined him according to the laws of the ANC, and they chased him away because he loved his country and politics and he started his political party in 2013 and now he brought up he's the second biggest in parliament actually his political party so the ANC put him out because he there was a conflict he wouldn't conform 
he wanted to take them in another Actually, direction. Actually, when, when, when they chased him away, he was the leader of, of the youth league, of the ANC Youth League. Oh, that's how he built the FF. Yeah, he was the leader of the ANC Youth League. Okay. And, and Malema, as a youngster, he made a mistake of, I don't know what he did, but it was a mistake according to the, to the laws and the clause of the ANC. But they couldn't discipline him and set him down. They chased him away. They said he was ill-disciplined and that, blah, 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 blah. He tried his best to come back to the party because he loved the party. And then he was chased away. But they went to Mama Winnie Mandela, of, told, told her about what happened. And also, Mama Winnie Mandela also was not in line with the, with the, with the Women's League of the ANC. He was accused of this and that and that mm -hmm. and that and that. Mm -hmm. He stayed in his house, in her house in, in, in Orlando. As the person, Winnie Mandela, when all the political parties were closed, she was the only person in this country was pronouncing the name of the ANC and the freedom of a black child in this country. All the men that we see today, they, were, they ran away, they were shot. That's what I was they saying. were cowards. That's what I was saying. It seems like now they may have made some alliances. Like, 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 like run, run the yeah, people who yes. disrupt them out yes. so they can have some, you know, some conformity and some yeah. agreements to, yeah. move, to move forward as a party. Yeah. Not for the people, but for a few, a few to benefit. Yeah. Yes, like, like, like. Like in 19, in 1955, ANC had an alliance with the with the with the with the trade union and the Communist Party. It was not like as the party alone. They brought in the Communist Party and the trade union. So it was a it was a triangle. That's why now other 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 political parties were not satisfied with the ANC leadership because they brought in the Communists and the trade union. So they were, they, were, they were not happy, that's why they, they, they split from the party. Because even today, the ministers that you see today in the ANC, that were, that, that were brought up, for, because we vote for the, for, the, for the political party, and that political party, the president of that political party, is the one who chooses the ministers. So even the ministers that are there today, even today, they, they are not politically sound. Some of them, like the Minister of Education today, he's not a politician. He was he was a secretary for, 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 for the Communist Party. He's a communist. He's not a politician. So that's what the difference is. So that, that's why that's why the current president of the AFF, uh, Julius Malem, is telling them in, pre, in, in, in Parliament that you are not political sound. You are not a politician. You were brought in the ANC because of this. Because he knows them, he tells them in the face. So that, that, that's how the, the, the politics of today are in South Africa.